Hey guys, welcome back. Welcome back to the channel. Welcome back to the vlog. If you're new, I'm Steve Chapman, and today we're doing another unboxing. And which one is it? It is Bass Baits Monthly. This is our fourth month with Bass Baits Monthly, and uh, the first month I was not happy. Took your uh, trusted y'all, and y'all said stick with it. Months two and three was exceptionally happy with the subscription tackle box that they put out. Now, if you don't know about this box, it is $35. It comes out every month, and you get, hopefully, some really good tackle in it. The la like I said, the last couple months has been phenomenal, so I'm really excited to get this and to see what's in it. I haven't looked at it. I've cut it open, but have not looked in it, so together, we're going to look at this thing and see what is in it. Is it worth it? Is it name brand products? and just go through it really fast. So hopefully you like this. If you do like the content, hit that thumbs up and make sure you subscribe to the channel because there's more stuff like this and closer looks. And then the new podcast with Mr. Bass too. So make sure you are part of the team and thank you. So here we go. Like always, they start us off with a uh, little brochure that tells us how to make a certain knot. The Alberto knot. I do not know how to make that one, but uh, I appreciate that they gave that to us. Um, and then they gave us a Bass Baits monthly sticker too. And a sticker person. Okay, well they started us off with a Berkeley Warbull 6.0 or 60. Maybe it's a 60 for the size. This is a top water bait, two and a half inches, 60 millimeters. 2.5 ounces and uh, it is a knocker. You can hear it. Not bad. Good way to start off. Oh, I like the next one. The Boom Boom Frog from Stanford Baits. I like this bait. I don't know if you can see. It has that little patch on the top. And supposedly that little patch or Velcro, it makes bass hold on to the bait or this frog a lot better. This is a really good frog. I got one of these uh, a couple years ago at iCast. Uh, and uh, it skips really well. It's collapsible. And that is, that is my jam right there. That black, that is my jam. I love it. We are two for two. Next. You don't realize how hot it is with, with these damn lights on to make you light up this room. Next from Spro, this is the RK Crawler MD55. It dives four to eight feet, so probably I'm not going to use that. Good looking color though, but for down here in Florida, that's just, uh, that's, that's at the range of too deep. Okay, next from Powerbait in Berkeley, they gave us the Power Hog. A full pack of power, full pack of these. These are good. It's nice to see. Next from Gambler, a great lure, the Easy Swimmer, in arguably my favorite color, black blue. This is a great bait. This is a great swim bait. If you can just rig this normal ewg hook or a jig or whatever and you can put this through put it put it through everything and bass swallow these they kill these things gambler makes a great product oh there isn't a lot in this month next from santone lures the original buzz bait three eighths ounce i'm not don't know anything about santone but it's got a mustad hook and it looks looks decent I'm not a big buzzbait person for whatever reason. And then last but not least, they sent us some Gamagatsu 3 out hooks. And this is a real pack. This isn't a, like a sample pack. This is a five pack. So that's kind of good too. Now I'm not, will I use them? I'll put them in as a giveaway, but this is still a decent hook, but I'm a Daiichi person. So uh, that's what, well, I mean, that's it. That's all that's in this month. There's, I don't really call ter count terminal tackle as lures, so in my box I got six. I got three hard baits, the Spro, the Boom Boom Frog, the War, 
what is this called? The Wake Bowl is what it's called. Sorry. And then the Power Baits and the Easy Easy Swimmers from Gambler. So, in terms of brand recognition, surprisingly, I know everybody in here. I have seen, I think they must have a deal with these guys because I think I've gotten a lot of these lately from them, this, this company. It's actually a really light lure. Um, so, but in terms of name brand recognition, I probably would give this maybe an eight, eight and a half. Most of these guys I do know, do know them well. Berkeley Spro, Gambler, Power Bait, Berkeley. And you guys might not know Stanford Baits, but I do. Uh, they make, they do make, this is, this is a great frog. This is really a great frog. And the Gamagatsu, so pretty decent. In terms of fishability, I think the only thing I'm not going to fish in here, or wouldn't use, is probably that Spro. And that's just too deep of a, a bait to dive to, to use down here. Uh, I use the I use the swimmers. Uh, you want to be honest, I probably won't use the buzz bait either. Um, but overall, two out of the six. So there's four products I'm probably going to use. Isn't bad. Isn't bad. Is it as good as last month? I don't think so. And, you know, now what we'll do is we'll compare this versus Monster Bass in another video, and you can. You can see, well, actually, I don't think I can do that because I think I already broke apart the, the Monster Bass stuff. But you can go back and look at the Monster Bass video and see which one is better. Which one do you think is better? Comment below and tell me what you think. I'd love to know. I'm going to stick with these guys for sure. I don't think this was their strongest month, but I don't think it was a bad month either. And that is positive. And I think my nephew is going to love this, to be honest. He'll love everything in here. Guys. I hope you have a blessed day. Thank you for everything you guys do. Thank you for the comments. Thanks for being part of the team. Uh, I really do appreciate it. I really do appreciate it. You know, these these are weird times, and we're still kind of going crazy. And I really, honestly appreciate everybody. So thank you. Guys, remember, take a kid fishing. Get your fish on. We will see you soon. Cheers, guys. Like and subscribe, take your own kids fishing. <laughs>